Hello everyone, this is Malavar TC1. It's been a while since I've done a Final Fantasy Awakening video, and I wanted to show you guys what a level 90 account looks like. Not much has changed from the level 60 that I have shown you before in the past. The only difference between level 60 and level 90 is an added feature right here, which is kind of like a raid for certain boss types. Other than that, um, I think the last thing I showed you guys was this, which is kind of like a tower tower attack other than that as well the only difference that you can change in your characters is when they start getting red armors and stuff like that you can upgrade the armors by using the same puzzle pieces of that armor and it has a chance to even further the defense or attack on those red pieces of armor and and weapons that's about it there's not much to say otherwise there are still these events that you can try to pull for characters you don't have i already have that character so i'd rather just farm through the good old-fashioned method of the map here so you want to fill out this map and try to get it always running to get those characters up you want to check out what my characters look like as well at level 90 at 20 million power that's where i'm at right now that's where i'm you should be sitting if you're this high in the game and for those of you just starting off to get to 20 million power and level 90 takes a few months. It is no easy task. It is no simple feat. So just throwing that out there, if you want to start this game, and that's not even max level. Max level in this game is somewhere around 130, 140. And I think it even goes past that. But the very last thing you can unlock is around level 130, 140. And to get to level 90 took forever. It took like four or five months, I think this game's been out and it's probably going to take even longer to get to max level i plan on doing it because i plan on doing a video when i get to max level but i wanted to show the progress for final fantasy awakening so far you could still do the daily quest that's one of the best ways you can get as much experience as you want possible I gotta go collect that 100 that's the dailies right up here and you get 5,000 if you do all of those you can do all the missions as you do the missions if you get get up to certain levels you get 5,000 experience for those you want to check the new weekly updates as well depending on what level you're at and how far you've gone through the game these these increase these go up so make sure you always collect those that's a new feature that's been going on for a while other than that it's the same old same old Always check the treasures to see if there's anything, especially if you've bought diamonds, you get extra treasures. If not, just make sure you check through all these to make sure you're collecting everything that you can while you're going through it. This is just a Final Fantasy Awakening video for those of you who, like I said, are just tuning in. This is the third or fourth Final Fantasy Awakening video I've done. You also want to do this every time you get up to a new level. Try to get the specific weapon, armor, and character slot for these to build those up and make sure your team kind of revolves around each other you can tell if they do by clicking this little button on the bottom left and it will tell this has two out of four champions that go with that one three out of four with that one one out of four with that one three out of four the more you get the better it is and you want to build up those to every every 20 levels i think does an increase in every i think like twenty thousand or fifty thousand does a little bit of an increase and you want to do that on the side mainly focus on your main ones because those increases on the side are very minute so these are just a few more tips and tricks getting up to higher level once you're even at this level it's really it's really intense because i'm in a guild right now where i'm i'm level 17 or number 16 on the board now because i recently went up and boost but look at these people right here 94 million for this top person level 101 this person you know has dropped like thousands of dollars on this game there's i've been playing since this released in china um since it released in hong kong i think uh yeah which, whichever part where this first released i'm not even playing the english version this is on the the first version that came out since it's been re-released so this person's been probably dropping tons of money and you could tell that just by how much farther they are ahead of everyone else the other people i'm sure are dropping some but not as much and in order to really progress in this game it is sort of a pay to win you can just grind and you'll be okay but it will take a lot longer so that's my tips and tricks for final fantasy awakening 
Again, you can check out the earlier videos to get better tips and tricks up to level 65. And like I said, from 60, 65 to here, not much has changed. And not much is probably going to change once you get to max level either. So that's just an update. This has been Mal of RTC1. Make sure you like and subscribe and check out my other videos and make sure to enter this month's giveaway. Um, that's a video that's a few videos back, like 10 videos back, for a chance to win a Pokemon Ultra Moon or Ultra Sun game. Yeah, check that out. Thanks.